Hello, it's me again, James. Last time we did median, and this time we're doing symmetry. So, as you can see here, we have uh, a triangle and a square, and then a line going through it. And then a line going through, through it. In symmetry, what you'll have is you'll have one thing on one side of a line, so that's the triangle and the square, and then you have to mirror that, so make it look the same on the other side. So, let's say you've got this triangle here, you'd have to do a, a a, the same triangle on this side. Basic. So, let's start with this little square inside the triangle. You can see that um, this square has um, is two squares long, Two of these little squares long, so one, two, and two squares, and two squares wide. That's one, two. So that means that, and um, if it's like that on that side, because it's symmetry and meant to mirror it, it's got to be the same on the other side. So you'll see here, uh, as it's two squares out this way. This way, it's got to be two squares out this way as well. One, two. So you've got from here to here. So just as you just as you would have here. Then you've got to go from then you do that. It's too wide, so you go like this. One, two. Yep. It's two squares that way, so do the same here. And then that we have mirrored on the other side. So that's the symmetry of that square. And then you've got to do the triangle. So that triangle goes through an entire big square. And so if I just slide this over here for a minute. Diagonally you've got to do the same. Like that. So that's the... So we've mirrored that part of it. It's a, it's a whole big square out. So one big square that way, one big square that way, and there. And on this side, it's the same. It's one big square that way, one big square that way, goes ends there. And so that is the symmetry of of the square and the triangle that you saw at the beginning and it's now become a square and a rectangle now there isn't really a simple trick you can do with symmetry like you can with median you just got to kind of all, all you can really do is just do this on the other side and a good way of doing that is using either um, squares on graph paper if, you're, if the paper you're using has those or you can just use a ruler, so you can measure how many millimetres or centimetres um, it is for one thing. So, for example, here it is um, about a centimetre, and then you just do a centimetre out on this side. But the paper I'm using does have squares on it, so I'm going to use those. Let's start this side. You see here... Um, it's three of those little squares out, so about about here, so three squares out is where you would put your line, and then you can see it goes in for three squares. So I'm going to draw that. Uh, it goes up for one, two, three, four, two, three, four, five, six. Yep, and then it goes up for three. Up for three, and then it goes uh, back down here for six. And 
that will go just about there, so that's six squares down. And then it goes across here for one, two, three, four, five, six. So again, or you could just call that a whole square from where you are. What's up there? If this doesn't work, it is a, it can it can work if you uh, put a dot where it'd be. So that's six squares up, six squares up here is there. If you just put dots and then so six across there, one, two, three, four, five, six. Put a dot there, then it goes in for six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Put a dot there. That that can also work. It just depends on what you find easiest. You can do dots or you can just draw lines. And then at the end if if the if what's on there looks the same as what's on there, just the other way around, then that's how you know you've done it. That's about it. That's all you can do with symmetry. If there's if there's anything you know about symmetry that I've not mentioned here, or if uh, you want more clarification and I have came up with a way to give it, then just say so. Then you can um, go and leave a comment, or you can just email me at jamesteachesmaths at gmail dot com. So uh, if this helped, then you're welcome. Goodbye.